This is your New Sport Update, powered by the Bomarito Automotive Group. I'm Julia Avery with your News 4 update. Owners of small shops and businesses across the St. Louis area are hoping holiday shoppers will steer clear of the malls and big box stores and visit them for today's Small Business Saturday shopping promotion. The campaign started just over 10 years ago in response to Black Friday. This year's Small Business Saturday is considered especially important as many small businesses did not survive the pandemic. The Thanksgiving weekend is also the kickoff for many area light displays. Alton's Christmas Wonderland light display threw the on switch yesterday. You can drive through Rock Springs Park and enjoy more than 4 million lights. More sights and sounds of the season. Thousands braved the chilly temperatures yesterday morning for the Belleville Santa Parade. This parade has been held since 1952. Bands, fire trucks, dance groups all leading the way for Santa and Mrs. Claus. Now let's get right to the weather with Leah Hill, your weekend forecast. It's going to be a beautiful one this afternoon. Temperature 61 degrees and then we flip things 60 or 47 degrees for the high temperature tomorrow. Front passes through tonight and that's going to bring about this temperature change. So let's walk through this with the super predictor. First, we had a warm front passing through yesterday. That's why we're seeing those mild conditions today. Winds from the southwest and they'll be breezy at times, but overall we're going to be very comfortable. Well, unfortunately, this warmer air doesn't last because quickly tonight a cold front passes through and as it does, it's going to bring a return of those chilly temperatures. Now, normally when we think about those cold fronts, we think rain with it. Well, that's not going to be the case with this cold front passing through tonight. Some clouds will roll through with it. We'll get a wind shift. They're coming from the south today. They'll come from the north tomorrow. But the big story with this front is that we're going to see slightly cooler temperatures. So for the next couple of days, we cool things down and then Monday, Tuesday, we start that warm up process once again. Wednesday is the first day of December and we're going to be seeing temperatures for the first week of December well above the average.